Hey guys, Logic X here, and today I'm going to show you how to set up uh, mind control and motion and joy so you can play Minecraft using your PS3 controller or Xbox controller. So, the first thing you want to do is open your web browser and browse to motionenjoy.com and then go to the download link right there and it will take you to the download page and then select the version that's good for your computer so for me it's 64-bit uh, Windows 7 so this bit here okay then go to your downloads folder and extract it and then open it and then you're going to install it So now you're going to run it. Okay, and this might take a minute or two depending on how good your computer is to open up. And then it will want to install some drivers and um, allow changes maybe if you're on Windows 7. Okay, so now they're in this part. What you want to do is get your controller and connect it to your computer using either your. Or your uh, USB cable probably is what you probably have. Like I've got my charger cord which is connected to uh, the USB right now. Okay, so this detected it. Now if yours doesn't get detected just go to drive manager and then click on that and then do load driver. See, mine's loaded already, so it's good to go. So then, okay. <coughs> so now what you want to do once it's connected to it? What the heck? Oh, it should work. Okay. Well, if you go Xbox 360 controller emulator, and then, uh, okay, and then you go. Yep. Okay. Now what you need is mind control. So. Google search mind control and it's this link here okay so now you just download that for clicking here and then open it once you've uh, <coughs> once you got it this is a Java app so you're gonna need Java but I assume you you would have Java since you play Minecraft. Okay, see, and it should open now. And then what you need to do? What's happening here? <coughs> there we go. So let's pick that up now. If, if it doesn't have it, just look through your list or try restarting it, then it should work. Uh, so now I can control the mouse using my PS3 controller. See, I'm using the right analog stick now and uh, R2 at the moment. So, all you need to do now is configure the controls the way you want them. So, uh, these are the Xbox controls, so just remember the layout. So, Y is at the top, which would be triangle on PS3. Uh, X would be, I believe, square. Uh, B would be circle, and A would be X. So, for A, we're going to want to have space for jump. For B, I use inventory, so I. For X, we have Q, which is drop, um, and Y, um, well that can just be um, F5, which is change views. Now the right joystick button, uh, <coughs> I guess you could just leave that as well, and that 
that should be that should be fine. Now uh, we'll just open up Minecraft real quick. select Hold on. No, you won't. I've got to set the right shoulder button which is R1 for PS3 I'm not sure what it would be for um, Xbox it would be one of the right back triggers or something but um, you want to select uh, mouse 1 so now you should be able to select the R1 yep. and the back button for uh, Xbox on the right, whatever that is. <coughs> so now we're in game, and you have full control of Minecraft with your PS3. You can delete blocks, uh, you can place blocks, Y, or triangle, square drops, circle opens inventory, you can press R1 and use the, an the analogs to um, move it up and down select uh, other things to put in here so place them down make a pretty house or something, I don't know maybe get in the middle of the earth if you want but yeah um, thanks for watching, Hope you've, hopefully you found this helpful uh, yeah, so thanks for watching, see ya